Here's the story behind this check, where Donald Trump donated to Kamala Harris, which today seems very surprising. But Trump and his family used to give money to a lot of different politicians, including his two prior presidential opponents. So I've given to Hillary, I've given to everybody, because that was my job. When I want something, I get it. When I call, they kiss my ass. So that $5,000 check to Harris is from 2011. According to a complaint from Trump's team in 2013, that donation started when the Attorney General of New York at the time, Eric Schneiderman, reached out to Trump's daughter, Ivanka, saying he would would greatly appreciate it if she would be his guest at a fundraiser he was hosting for Kamala Harris. She had just been elected AG in California. Schneiderman's reps also asked Ivanka if her father would make a $5,000 donation to Harris's campaign fund, according to the complaint. This picture of the check of that donation was included in this filing, which again is an ethics complaint that Trump brought against Schneiderman back in 2013, accusing the AG of trying to get donations like this from Trump back in 2011. At the same time, the AG was investigating Trump University for defraud students. Schneiderman's spokesperson said he hadn't solicited Trump for campaign donations since the AG took office in January 2011. He had met socially with Ivanka Trump, his office said, but she wasn't an official of Trump U, nor was she under any other investigations by the AG. So his office felt no ethical problem. But Trump in his complaint accused Schneiderman of telling Trump's people the investigation was going nowhere. So Trump made the donation and Ivanka went to the fundraiser. Two years later, Schneiderman's office formally filed a lawsuit against Trump University and this complaint followed. The ethics board later dropped the complaint in 2015, and Trump reached a $25 million settlement with Trump U students shortly after the 2016 election. But also in 2016, as Harris was running for an open Senate seat in California, her Democratic opponent repeatedly tried to connect her to Trump, both from this donation and another $1,000 one that Trump made to Harris in 2013. Loretta Sanchez suggested there was a connection between these donations and why the state hadn't brought charges against Trump University while Harris was AG. Harris's campaign in 2016 slammed the allegations as baseless and ridiculous, saying her predecessor had already looked into it and didn't bring a case. And her team later told CBS News that she'd given the funds to a nonprofit group, pushing for civil and human rights for Central Americans in 2015. Trump's campaign spokesman told me, at the time, Trump was a global businessman and knew how to play the game. 